Hello everyone, welcome back to Odyssey Podcast. This t- today is podcast twelve, and we were joined by Jack Petty Winners. Could you could you lot introduce yourselves, please? I'm Jasmine. I'm the Dim. I'm the Mood. I'm Carice. I'm Jennifer. I'm Zachariah. And my co-host today is Sade. Hello. <clears throat> okay, so guys, I'm gonna ask you a range of questions. So just be open, don't be shy, <laughs> you know, don't be shy, it's okay. Um, the first question is for Zach. Um, what is Jack Petchy? Uh, so Jack Petchy is a foundation founded by Jack Petchy, a man who dropped out of his education in year 10, and it aims at helping mainly year 10s to develop skills that will benefit them in later life. Okay, okay. The next question is for Jasmine. What did you do in your Jack Petchy experience? So throughout the whole day, um, we were taking part in different activities. We had this booklet that we had to work off of if we wanted to take notes or get different key things that we wanted to use in the speeches. And we had a woman there to guide us. She was really nice. So that's what we did. Okay. So Nadir, what was the day like for you? The day was very good overall because we learned a lot of things that would later on help us in life, like how to use our hands uh, if we're speaking in front of people. We got out of our pusillanimous ways of like being shy and stage fright and stuff like that. So we learned a lot on the day was very good. See, now I'm interested. What were your speeches about? All right. So mine was about motivation. Mine was about respecting people's faiths and religions. Mine was about comfort food. Mine was about alcohol and drugs and the impact it has on you. Mine was about relationships. Mine was about food as well. Oh, so what did you learn about it? Um, I learned to take myself out of my comfort zone and to also express um, our feelings and to also express how we feel about a particular subject and to also be confident and to not be afraid to share our ideas with others. We also learned to gesticulate and use the stage at, um, as to further alleviate our speeches and to further emphasise our points. So to really use up to deliver the speeches, not just with our mouths, but also with our bodies. Um, I also learned that you can speak about whatever you want, but as long as you learn how to articulate yourself correctly, everyone will listen to you. Do you have anything to say, Jennifer? No, you sure? Okay, okay. So Jasmine, what happens next? Um, since all of us got into the finals, we're not necessarily sure how long it will take for us to get together, but um, we have to see our speeches again and develop them even more. One of us will be picked and we'll be saying our speeches and competing with different schools, which is actually really nerve wracking, but it's also a really big opportunity. Lemieux, why did you decide to take part? Well, first of all, I wanted to miss English, <laughs> but I'm um, just joking. It seemed like a new experience because, of course, I'm going outside of my comfort zone and we learnt lots of new skills and it seemed like they could benefit me in later life. Jennifer, why did you decide to take part? I decided to pick part because I thought it would like make me more confident and it's just something I needed for, like, for example, speaking exams. It's something I need to learn. Nadir, why did you take part? I took part because I knew I was going to miss like a lot of lessons on that day and uh, overall I thought it was going to be fun and it was so that's very good. Carice, why did you take part? I took part because it would definitely take me out of my comfort zone. It would teach me to be more confident in myself and speaking with others and to also help me um, with further opportunities later in my life. Jasmine, why did you take part? Um, Definitely just to get over different fears because when I talk to people like my friends I've always been so confident but when I'm around crowds and it's only just me and everyone's focused on me. I get kind of scared, so it's kind of to get over the fear of stage fright. Zachary, why did you take uh, that? For me as well, as well, it was to help myself in the future, to give myself more opportunities, for example, in later life and in jobs. And I thought that would really benefit me in the long run. Okay, thank you guys for coming to today's podcast. I appreciate all your time. This is podcast number 12, PBS out. Shoot.